my pen. It's about 25 feet by 4 feet. All I have in here are, are two female eastern box turtles and I have a, another a male Florida box turtle which I don't think they've successfully bred. Not like not a good thing to breed crossbreed subspecies, but that's what it is. There's Floyd. Hey Floyd. Floyd is a male Florida box turtle, Terrapina Carolina Bowery. There he is. There's a banana I threw in here. Hopefully we'll get over to that banana. I think Juliet is smelling the bananas that are over there. I don't feed them bananas that often, but I know they like them a lot. I figured it would be good for the video. Unfortunately, the sun is behind me, so you're getting my shadow and everything here. This is the morning. I placed this pen here on purpose because it gets the morning sun. They love because they love to they love to get that morning sun and get warmed up. Yeah, that's banana. Like, holy cow, we haven't had banana in a long time. <laughs> like banana. And that is Juliet. Adopted her from a guy in Jersey City. God. Oof, years and years ago, at least 16, 15, I don't know, between 15 and 20 years ago, and she came with Carla, which was her roommate. And this guy had them, I believe, in an apartment in Jersey City, so they didn't exactly have the best situation there, so I'm sure they're a lot happier here. I keep them outdoors year-round. They hibernate in here. Oh, it's Woody Woodpecker in the background there. But, um, yeah, they're here all year round. They throw in grass and hay in here right before the winter, so they got something to burrow down into to hibernate. And they've, they've been doing well here. They've been here as long as we've lived here. Oh, I don't know, like 12, 13 years now we've lived here. 14 years maybe? I don't know. I can never keep track. But they've been here, and they do well. I just realized a good sign of how long this pen has been here is this uh, tree was not here when I first built this pen and this little tree grew in here and it's a pretty good sized tree now which is funny I just let it grow and here it is they have a tree in the middle of the pen here <laughs> I just added these clay pots I don't know if you can see one down there I had a clay pot on my deck that cracked so I figured what the heck I broke it in half and I made shelters as the other half is down there and that's it and I need to get rain water here's one it's got leaves and stuff in it but they love that they go and they sit in the water it's very very natural I keep this as natural as possible I try not to uh, interfere with this at all that's a very natural setting for them Lots of things to hide under. They got all sorts of. There's a big hollow log here. They love that. The only thing that isn't natural is I have that stone down there. I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of like a fake stone cave, but they like that too. Even though it's not really natural. It kind of looks natural, but it's not. I'm going to go down and see what Floyd's doing. There's Floyd. He's fully awake now, look at him, he's waking up. I think he smells the bananas over there, my bananas, I'm not sure. He might sense that I'm sitting here and he's like, hmm, don't know if I want to move yet. Carla found some kind of bug.
of this town. It's a little tiny earthworm. I'll toss it in there and see if Carla sees it. Oops. Digesting some banana. I think Juliet's down there somewhere, but she stopped eating banana. She's done with banana. And Carla's having fun foraging, looking around for worms and stuff. So that's it. That's my turtle pen for now.